Let me ask you this. How was the last diet that you went on? Do you feel overwhelmed by the thought of having to choose between low carb, keto, paleo, or another crazy diet that will have you feeling good for a few weeks, but will leave you hungry, exhausted, and eventually lead to a rebound? And with that rebound comes a feeling of doubt and hopelessness because you don't know what to do next and everything that you have tried has either not worked or only worked for a short time and now you're so overwhelmed that you don't take action towards your goals. Listen, I was right there with you. I promise I've tried all the diets including intermittent fasting, counting calories, chicken and broccoli only, seriously, you name it. And guess what? They all worked. Every diet works, but nothing works forever. I refuse to count calories every meal. I happen to love carbs. In fact, food is actually one of my favorite things. And I w refuse to drive myself crazy, miss out on the pleasures of great tasting food, and have to miss time out with family and friends, all because it doesn't fit my diet at the time. So here is what I did. I started cooking, and at first I sucked. I burned my mom's pots and pans, ate more inedible food than I'd ever like to admit, and even had to throw most of it away. But with practice, I started getting better. I found a few staple recipes I began making over and over, and I got good at them, but then I got bored with them. I made a pretty damn good omelet. We made some good grilled chicken, but I couldn't eat it for the rest of my life when my family was eating all the good stuff. So here's what I did. I made cooking a hobby. I bought dozens of recipe books, scoured the internet for healthy and delicious recipes, found some good ones from each. None were perfect at first, so here's how I tweaked them to my liking. Most importantly, I played around with the ingredients to make them healthier and more body composition friendly. I switched flour out for almond flour, changed the kind of sauce while finding a way to keep the same great taste. I'm a meticulous note taker, so I started keeping these new recipes in a Word document. A client heard about it who I was helping with their nutrition, so I sent the Word document over to them. His friend, also a client, heard about it too, so I sent it to her too, and it really helped them get back on track with their nutrition while keeping it sustainable. So they forced me to write it in a book, and I did, and I'm actually incredibly proud of it. So proud that I'd love to give it to you for free because it's helped so many of my clients so far. But all I ask is that you pay for the shipping. We're a small company, and I'd love to get this book into your hands for free, but I can't afford to give all of these away with the high shipping costs these days. So I'll give you the book, and all you have to do is cover the small cost of shipping.